Hey everybody, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I am looking back at the mega hit TV series MASH, and more specifically, I'm taking a deeper look into whatever happened to Johnny Hamer, the actor that played Sergeant Zell Moselle from season 2 through season 8. Now MASH is widely considered to be one of the greatest television shows ever made, and much of the show's success had to be contributed to the outstanding cast who portrayed the doctors and nurses of the 4077th Mobile Army Surgical Hospital. And in the case of MASH, it really was the contributions of everyone, from the biggest stars to the supporting cast members that really made this show shine. The show wouldn't have been the same without the talents of actors such as Kelly Nakahara, Jeff Maxwell, Alan Arbus, G.W. Bailey, Edward Winter, and this guy, Johnny Hamer, who played Sergeant Zelmo Zell across 20 episodes spanning seven seasons. Hamer had been acting in various television roles since the mid-50s, with MASH really being one of his first big breaks in television. On many of the episodes that he would appear in, his character would be at odds with Corporal Maxwell Klinger, and the two would generally need to be separated before coming to blows. And by the middle of the 8th season of M.A.S.H., the character of Zell would disappear and another character would be added to the cast of M.A.S.H., that of Sergeant Luther Rizzo, played by the wonderful actor G.W. Bailey. Now I've read various reasons as to why Johnny Hamer's character of Sergeant Zell was never heard of again, including that Hamer made the choice to leave because of an illness, but I believe that in reality, the producers just chose to move on and not renew his contract, and they decided to go in a different direction by bringing in G.W. Bailey's Sergeant Rizzo. Following his time on MASH, Hamer would do vocal work in 16 episodes of the 1979 through 1980 Saturday morning cartoon, The Plastic Man Comedy Adventure Show. And in 1982, he would be cast as the butler, Walter Pinkerton, in the sitcom Madam's Place that would run for just one season. Although, due to airing daily, Hamer would appear in 55 episodes during that single season. Throughout the 1980s, Hamer would continue to find acting jobs in a variety of TV shows, with quite a bit of vocal work for animated television shows such as Spider-Man and His Amazing Friends, Alvin and the Chipmunks, and the Transformers series. On November 18, 1989, Johnny Hamer would pass away after a battle with cancer. His career in the entertainment industry spanned for over 40 years, starting out working in nightclubs and then moving on to television and movies. While doing some research about Mr. Hamer's career, one thing I ran across was a video channel here on YouTube under the name of Donna Hamer, where there are recordings of music performed by James W. Hamer, who I believe is Johnny Hamer's son. Now he sure looks a lot like Johnny Hamer to me. I will post a link to the channel in the description for this video but you can easily find it by searching for Donna Hamer. I particularly enjoyed the song called Song for My Sons. Give it a listen. Here's one last picture of Johnny Hamer and MASH along with Gary Berghoff, Jamie Farr, and Jeff Maxwell from the season four episode of MASH titled Soldier of the Month. It's a hilarious episode if I do say so myself. Now who remembers Johnny Hamer from MASH? And how many of you remember Madam's Place? I look forward to reading your comments. Also, I would greatly appreciate it if you would consider subscribing to my channel. I mostly talk about the music, movies, and TV shows that I watched as a kid growing up in the 70s, 80s, and 90s. Thank you so much for watching. Stay safe out there, and have a great day.